I decided to do my economics postgraduate because I was still curious and I just felt like if I studied further that maybe I'd get a more deeper understanding of the field. Um, for me it was a lucky accident. Um, I was doing law undergrad um, and I took economics as an extra subject um, and luckily I just, I just I loved it. That, I'd have to say, in third year, I was an economics mentor and I met, through the mentorship program, I met some of the lecturers on a more personal level and some of the postgraduate students and I was very impressed. My decision was based on the, the specialisation that I prefer, which is development economics and institutional economics, and I found that Stanimosh um, was much stronger in that. After coming and doing my honours at Stellenbosch, I stayed on for my master's because I, I really enjoyed being part of the economics department. I felt like they really drew me into the field and made me really want to pursue my studies even further. I'd have to say it's because of developmental economics. These people are recognised not only locally but also internationally for their, their research but also for their, their, their policy advice they give to governments all over the world. Well, Stellenbosch at this point is producing the most and the highest quality economics research in the country. We uh, developed a patent through my research where we do anti-piracy protection with Bitcoin. So my thesis was on the, the second round effects of uh, piracy on the profitability of uh, the film industry. So I'm currently looking at um, updating a poverty profile for South Africa. So I'm using the latest survey data that we have in order to kind of deconstruct and decompose what poverty looks like today. I'm doing my honours research project in, on land reform, specifically um, tenure reform with regards to farm workers. Um, so I'm looking from an institutional economics perspective at a power imbalance between landowners and farm workers and how this might potentially impact profitability. My current research is on economic history, so I'm working on um, the Cape Panel project and it primarily deals with the eastern um, Cape frontier, so the Grafenet district. So um, my project is basically dealing with frontier economics. My future plans, um, so for the short term I am going to start working next year, which I'm excited about. I'll be going into competition economics, so I'll be working with Econix. Um, I want to do my masters next year, uh, specialising in environmental economics. Um, maybe taking on a postdoctoral position after I complete my PhD in 2018 and then hopefully publish as much as possible to get and teach as much as possible because I really like working with the students. Um, my honours year has been by far the most challenging and rewarding year of my life um, and I just think it, uh, it, it opened up an entire new world for me, especially in, into a new discipline and, um, and a new way of thinking. Yeah, that was great. I really enjoyed it, both the honours and the master's degree. Um, it's a degree that will really challenge you, but in a wonderful way. So you might not always understand why the work is relevant at the moment, but it builds on itself in a way that you don't really find in a lot of other degree programs. So Stellenbosch's postgraduate qualification more than anything um, contributed to my ability to, 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 to express myself and to explain complex concepts in the most, the easiest way for people to understand. Doing an economics postgraduate is very different to doing the undergrad. You feel like you're getting more attention and also that you you really understand what economics is now really about. Don't judge economics by the first year course content. It gets a lot more interesting after that. Find the subject matter that you feel most passionately about. Put in the effort. Make some effort on your essays. You can make it really interesting for yourself. And the more you put in, the more you're going to get out of it. 
this is not about getting a degree. This is about developing yourself into a full human being.